Hi first graders, Mrs. Draper here to help you with your writing today. So today we're going to be writing our opinions. So here on the last page of the text, we can look and see a guide to writing our opinions. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to say what our opinion is. And that's called stating our opinion. We are going to give reasons to support that opinion. And today we are going to work on three reasons to support the opinion. The last thing that we are going to do is we're gonna do something called a conclusion. And what that sentence is going to do is it's going to take that opinion that you said in the first sentence, and we're gonna say it again in a slightly different way using different words, and that's called restating something. So we are going to restate our opinion and reason at the end. I had to think, which good or service that we read about this week do I feel is the most important good or service? What is my opinion? And what reasons do I have to support that opinion? Maybe some of those reasons are in the book, the same reasons that maybe this little boy has or this little girl has, or maybe they're things from our own life. So I had to pick one of the goods and services to do an example for you. And I was thinking about where we are right now and what's going on in the world. And that really helped me to decide that I was, I'm going to pick doctors and nurses because I really feel right now that doctors and nurses are the most important. Oh, you want to know what my reasons are? Hmm. Well, make sure that you pick yours and start thinking about your reasons as we go along and I give you an example of how I'm doing mine. The first thing that I did was go back and reread that page in the book. Next, I thought about three reasons why I think doctors and nurses are the most important. Then I was ready and I got my packet page that looked like this. And the first part I had to write my topic sentence. So I wrote, doctors and nurses are the most important. Then I had to come up with three reasons. So I was thinking about what's going on, the, on in the world right now. And I was thinking about everybody in the hospitals. And I was thinking a reason that I have that's not in the book is they help sick people even though they could get sick too. Reason two was in the book, but I also believe it. They save people's lives. And reason number three, this one was also in our text, and I have this opinion also. I also think and feel this, so I'm going to put it in my paper. They give medicine to help people feel better. But you notice I tried to put things in my own words and not copy it directly from the book. And then our next job is to write our concluding sentence. And that's where we take the ideas and put it together and restate it. So I put doctors and nurses keep people alive and well. And that is the most important service. Next, I turned the page and I thought I could give my writing today a title. So I'm going to title mine, Hospital Heroes. And I came up with a sentence frame to help us write our topic sentence. And it's similar to the ones that we found in the book. In my opinion, hmm, hmm, the most important service. So I'm going to put, in my opinion, doctors and nurses are the most important service. But if you picked food, for example, you would say, in my opinion, food is the most important good. So make sure that you change it to fit what you're going to write. Next, we need to give our reasons in complete sentences, and we're going to give three. So when I took my three reasons from this page, I didn't copy them exactly, exactly, if I saw a way to make it better. And I actually did my reasons in my writing, 